Alright, let's see what's going on. I'm here. Are you ready to begin? Here's the gist. Malik's intelligence checks out. A rogue faction of SRS officers framed DedSec for the bombings to consolidate power over the government. But now they've noticed that some people are standing up to the new order and they're blaming you. Of course. I believe these are the people you call Zero Day. Oh, is the scapegoats? Right. Yes, yes, we stopped the leader. We stopped Zero Day. But why come to us now? Two weeks ago, a shell asking all the good questions. <laughs> How much? I was taking a sip of water when they said 40 fucking kilos of Samtex. Sound too bad. So if Malik's right, Zero Day are some kind of shadowy cabal of spies who blew up half the city to secretly take control of the government. But now they're pissed off that someone's standing up to them, so they're going to do it again. That's awful. Yeah, it is. I agree. You think they'd come up with something besides another bombing? Bit of a double beat, isn't it? <laughs> Sabine, be honest. Is this our doing? Is Zero Day doing this just because we're standing up? Shut up. I'd rather get blown up a thousand times than lie down just so some wannabe tyrants can stamp on my face. Yeah, shut about Bell, though. Alright, so we're going to go ahead. Uh, what's this? Oh, Malik's, uh, blah, 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 28 recording, 36 deaths. Uh, put me away from the rest of my life. Points to one thing, zero day. Anyway, we're going to go ahead straight there to the meetup. So, I'll catch you guys in a couple of seconds. All right, so now we're here. Taking some damage. Don't mind that. <coughs> personnel dossiers. The organization is strictly compartmentalized, so they aren't stored in one central location. Of course. About time we spied on the spies. So what's the plan? Sirs uses a supercomputer called Filament to process information drawn from the CTOS network. It's like Noodle if you could use it to search every document on every civilian, government, or commercial device everywhere in the United Kingdom instantly. Fucking hell. You can be horrified if you want, but it saved thousands of lives. Has it? Get access to a filament terminal and I'll provide I don't know if it really has. It seems like it killed more people than it hurt. Or it killed more people than it saved. Alright, so... Obviously I switched over to Gary because I have to sneak in here. As we know from previous episodes, when you go in guns blazing, people die. Um, if I could just figure out how they get the fuck in here, that'd be pretty cool. Oh, is it here? I don't think it's here. Um, hold on. Oh, maybe this is it right here. Hold on. Yep, I think this is it. Alright. So. Oh, yeah, this is it. Alright, so just act natural. Oh, shit. Let's just keep acting natural. Turn, turn, turn. Ooh. God damn, that was close. <coughs> Fucking hey, that was close. So, not really sure where to go. Oh shit! Okay. God damn, that was close. Huh? 
don't know what I sent him. I should have said I run him a giveaway or something. Alright, so... I think I'm getting close. Don't really know where to go, per se, though. Oh, there it is. There's the yellow I've been looking for. Okay, so just gotta cross this open uh, rooftop with a shit ton of people. Alright, that's fine. <sighs> there are so many fucking people. And drones, of course. Should I? No, I shouldn't. If I have them betray them, that will alert everybody. I can't. I'll shut them down. Uh, okay. Now you guys go get distracted by the down drone. And I'll sneak by. I was thinking about having having them betray, but honestly, um, it'd be too much commotion. Oh god damn, I'm getting I'm these are some close calls. Hey, shut up. Nothing, don't worry about it. Oh my goodness. I'm not liking all these close calls, not gonna lie. Give me the root kit, please. Thank you. Oh, son of a bitch. Too many close calls. Um, alright, spider bot. Cool. Open that. And is this fucking filament right here? Holy so shit. This is filament. Impressive. I can help you break in, but we're going to leave a trail. Unless, of course, Malik has an idea. There. I persuaded filament security to log that spider bot's activity as system maintenance. You're awfully helpful for a professional snoop. It's not like the movies. Spies aren't the police. Alright, so obviously I'm gonna have to figure out uh, a connection thing here, so I'm gonna speed it up so you guys aren't watching me trying to figure this shit out. Alright, here we go. Alright, that wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. Um, there we go. Alright, okay. Got those spy dossiers. Can't wait to see what's in here. Well done. Thanks. Alright, now I just gotta sneak back. Or... I could pull a cheeky move. I really don't want to sneak back. Um, fuck it. You know what? Fuck it. Fuck you guys. I'm going to do a cheeky way out. I think if I can find a transport drone, um, I think I can just sneak my way out of here. Oh, there. Perfect. While they're dealing with the drone, they're fighting, I can sneak away. Sweet. So I really didn't want to have to sneak back through. I nearly got caught three or four times, and that's not fun. Right, so we do a simple CTOS contact analysis and work out who's in charge of zero day. I'll have it done before you can say Guantanamo. 
I'll handle the classified data, thank you very much. It would be so much faster if I worked with you in order to do this. The people in these dossiers are connected, but not necessarily complicit. It will take intelligence expertise to separate the wheat from the chaff. And when I discover something actionable, I will contact you. All right. He's Holy dispatched. shit, he's a micromanager. Yeah, I'd say so. Fucking prick is what he is, but whatever. It would be so much quicker if a computer did it, but I guess at the same time, he's kind of right. Maybe. I don't know. What? I literally just talked to you. There's been a complication. I can't access the files you stole. Pardon? Whoa, 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 what? The files are locked, and a moment after we got them, I received this. A video? Oh, fucking A. Hello, Richard. Oh, fantastic. How'd they find out so fucking quick? They must got eyes and ears everywhere. That's a good idea. Maybe don't mind if we borrow it. Who was your masked savior? Oh, great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, we'll switch out we'll switch out into civvy clothes and I'll come up and meet you. Uh oh, great. How did Zero Day find out so damn quick? Eco warrior. I don't matter. Anyway, we're gonna go meet him. I'm gonna see you guys in a couple seconds. Alright, let's see what he has to say. That's not Richard right there. No, it's Billy. I'm gonna wait for him. Take up a little seat. Nope, there he is. No, don't get up. I need a high-ranking SIRS officer's biometrics. Eyes and fingers. That wasn't the deal. We're running out of fucking time. Keep your voice down. The data was encrypted. So what? Our AI can hack it. Not faster than I could, and I've tried. It's hopeless in the time we have. Look, if you don't help me, Zero Day wins. Which means we all die. Fuck me. So, do you need, like, the whole finger? No. High-res photos will do. The problem is it has to be the acting Home Office liaison. And sirs will burn their credentials if they're attacked. It's protocol. So you'll have to get them the old-fashioned way. Torture? Christ, no. <laughs> relationship. Get someone close and uh, take the photos covertly. All right. Sounds fun. This part of the craft can be... ugly. <laughs> Send someone who can handle it. Ugly? Okay. Ugly, huh? Ugly. Bagley, snail help here, please. I suggest you begin your relationship with the SIRS Home Office liaison the way you would with anyone. By meticulously poring over every detail of their life and hunting them down. Go on. The SIRS Home Office liaison is the bridge between the government and its intelligence service. Their office at Downing Street would be a good place to start your relationship. That's the plan, then. Police officers. All right, we're going to go and give him a little break, and we'll go ahead and, uh... Sorry, she just shocked me with her fucking outfit. Um, Where's our police officer? There she is. She hasn't been off the bench in a while, so, uh, we'll go ahead and bring her up to bat. She's been riding the pine a little too long. Home office liaison works here, but I'm not seeing them on any unsecured surveillance. Ah, but their assistants here. Start by hacking them. Okay. Oh, shut up. Him. 
Oh, this is easy. I mean, we all, all of our, all of our teammates can handle ugly, you know, they're prepared to do what needs to be done. But, uh, I figured Gary is always fucking carry, how always has the bricks on his shoulders, so I figured he'd give him a little break. Is that open? Can't tell if that's open. I hope it's open. Body. Yeah, you like that? Oh, yeah, get choked out. Urgh. Yeah, buddy. Don't mind me. Just a fellow police officer. What am I doing, bro? I'm just fucking going in loops. Go this way. I'm free, bitches. Sixteen email threads indicate the homeless liaison is a right lush. She spends most of her time down at the Three Hawker Boys. If you want to seduce, sorry, start a relationship with her, that's as good a place as any. Forward me the coordinates. Done. All right. Let's get out of your uniform. All right. You're gonna have to seduce the shit. Ooh. Oh, don't mind if I do. You're gonna have to seduce the shit out of her. Just whip out the. <laughs> Rip out them titties. <laughs> Alright. She's upstairs. Don't mind me, la di doo, la di dee, la di doo. What's this? The three hawker boys. Eh, nothing really important there. Fuck happened down there? Hey, how you doing? I find your face generally appealing. Is that good for you? Ooh, if that's how you treat a one-liner, I shudder to think of what you do with two. Goodbye. Having a bad day, are we? Have a drink. That helps. Oh, I'm in a great mood, actually. It's just that I'm wasting my scant leisure time fending off the advances of a haggard swamp creature. Fuck you! Not even in your wildest dreams, sweetie. Oof! Shot I down. The nuances of human interaction, but my analysis indicates that you aren't her type. Yes, very astute, Bagley. Quit your whining. There's plenty of fish in the sea. We've got the biggest saltwater aquarium in town. At least one of our fish. Yeah, 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 yeah. She doesn't like women. I. You never know nowadays, bro. I don't know if she likes women. Okay, so. James R oh, could be our choice. Let's see who else we got. Let's take a little look. Take a little look. Ooh, we could go with uh, Athrarv too. Oh, we could definitely go with Christopher as well. Oh, we could go with <laughs> Bob. I'm fi I'm I'm feeling Athrarv. Um, or maybe 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 Christopher. Um, let's go with Athwarv. Yeah, let's go with Athwarv. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you do nothing around here, bro, but you just got to do something for us real quick. 